good day guys! So today we are talking about the parts and the sections of a newspaper. So without further ado, let's get started. So today we were going to talk about the parts of a newspaper. Did you know that there are 11 parts of a newspaper? Yes! 11 parts of it. So the first one is the nameplate or the masthead. So I have here a newspaper, a broadsheet newspaper. So the first part is the nameplate or the masthead. This part, these bold lines or the bold um, letters are called the nameplate or the masthead. A newspaper's name printed in a special type on the front page. So again, these bold letters here in the above part is called the nameplate or masthead. The second part of a newspaper is the deck. A secondary headline which provides the additional info about the story. The third one is the byline. Name of the writer appearing under the article. It is under the article because this is a Korean newspaper. So the fourth part of the newspaper is a photo credit. This part. A reference to the source of a photograph. So it means the name of the picture who took the picture. So the fourth part of the newspaper is a photo credit. Photo credit means a reference to the source of a photograph. So in this newspaper, this part, it means the name of the person who took the photograph. So the fifth part of a newspaper is an what we call index, an alphabetized table of contents of the newspaper. So in this newspaper, this is the index. It's called market index. So it means the less or synchronized words. The sixth part of the newspaper is cut line. This is the cut line. A cut line in a newspaper is the word that describes the photograph or illustration. It may be run beside or above photographs to add variety and some cases to enhance the page layout or descriptive info appearing with a piece of art or also called a caption. The seventh part of the newspaper is graphic. This is the graphic where it's located because this is a Korean newspaper. A graphic is a combination of artwork or words which helps to visually explain a story. This is the graphic newspaper. So the next part of a newspaper is the jump line. Jump line is located here. Jump line is a line telling a reader where where the story is continued this part is the jump line the next part of a news newspaper is the lead lead is located here lead is the first sentences of a new story telling informing the reader of who where, where what when and sometimes how and why after the lead, we have a headline. The headlines we can see here, which is which is the part that the giving of the story can see here. Again, this is the headlines. The next part of a newspaper we call cut. Cut is photos or illustration. This is cut. Again. The last part of a newspaper is cut. So those are the 11 parts of a newspaper. Again, the nameplate, the deck, the byline here under the article, 
the photo credit here, the bold one, the graphic, the index in the upper part, the cut line here under the photo or under the picture, the jump line, the lead, this part, the headline, and lastly, the cut. So our next topic is all about the sections of a newspaper. Little did you know that there are also 11 sections of a newspaper. So the first one or the first section of a newspaper is what we call the general news. In this newspaper, this is the general news. This all of this. General news is the most important news in both local and abroad. These are also usually found on the front page of the newspaper. So this is the general news. And the next section of a newspaper is the local and foreign news section. This is the foreign section. And this is the local section. Contains news from towns and cities of the nation and abroad. And the next section of a newspaper is the editorial page. It contains the articles which called editorials. Editorials gives views and opinions of the ed editor or publisher on, on certain events and issues. The next is sports section. Sports section contains news and events of sports containing in or out in the country. The this section also contains well-known people in the world of sports. The next is the classified ad section. This section contains advertisement that fall under the categories like help, one thing, or lease, or sale, or something to buy. The sixth section of the newspaper is the business and finance section. This is the business and finance section. It contains businessmen and people interested in business with information on banking, foreign exchange rates, imports and exports, and prices of prime commodities. The seventh section of the newspaper is the entertainment section. This is the entertainment section. Contains info about movies, radio, television, and other activities for entertainment. So the next section is the home and culture section. So in this section, um, provides info about budgeting, food preparation, home improvement, and etc. So the next section is the society page. So society page contains news about um, important people who are celebrating in a particular place. The next section of a newspaper, travel and tourism section. This is a travel and tourism section. It contains a guide to travel and a direction tourists to a scenic vacation spot and gives information and its activity in these places. The last section of a newspaper's old announcement and obituary page. This is the this is the section of the, the last section of a newspaper. This is, this is provides info on the activities of different religious sections and it also lists people who recently died on the time and place of their burials. So those are the 11 sections of a newspaper. Again, the 11 sections of a newspaper are the general news, local and foreign section, sports page, editorial page, the classified ads section, business and finance section, entertainment section, home and culture section, society page, 
travel and tourism section and lastly the announcements and obituary section and that will be all thank you